Hello again, it's Jess or Jashi Karen, and welcome back for day 17 of my one month of my bullet journal or plan as you go series, where I show you how I use my bullet journal on a daily basis for the entire of November 2018. It's currently about 1pm where I am, which means as previously there are some things I can fill in and some things that I can't fill in right now, but let's get into it. So for today you can see I don't actually have any events on, but I do want to add one in for tomorrow. Normally I wouldn't put shopping down on my monthly lock, but I know that tomorrow I do need to go and get several key things that are beyond just regular groceries. In terms of my habit tracker, there are a couple of things I can fill in here as well. There will likely be a few other things I can check off by the end of today, but they haven't been done yet, so I'm going to leave them for now. On to my steps and mood tracker. I can fill out the number of steps I did yesterday. Because it's still the middle of the day, I'm not going to fill in my mood tracker just yet, but I'm going to leave that one until tomorrow instead. Onto my social media tracker, I have a few things that I can colour in here. I only just realised that I made an error when colouring this one in, it really should have been a light purple, but it's not that noticeable so I'm just going to leave it. Onto my meal log, I can fill in what I had for dinner last night and breakfast this morning. For my word of the day, again because we're only halfway through the day, I'm not too sure what I want to put here just yet, so I'm going to fill that one in tomorrow. For today's intentions, I have my budgeting, I want to start the new Sabrina TV series on Netflix, and I want to book my restricted driving test. I'm now going to go in, colour this page, and also add in today's doodle. The doodle prompt for today is Raydun Mug. I haven't actually heard of what this is before, so I had to Google it. And I don't understand why they're so popular, but I'm sure that there is a reason. So I'm going to go in and draw that one now. Didn't really plan that one out as well as I could, kind of ran out of room, but that's okay. I'm going to leave it. Before we move on, I just do want to add down one intention I have for tomorrow before I forget it. Buying these shoes is the reason that we're going on our shopping trip tomorrow. So I really want to make sure that I don't forget them because I need them next week. Before we finish today's video, I just want to show you a couple of the other things I've been doing in my journal. So I've gone and actually cut out my Dutch doors for next week and for the week after, and almost finished washi taping these little tabs. I've put myself in a YouTube plan and a plan for our trip to Toronga next week. And then I've also started thinking about what I want to do for my December setup. So as you'll have seen previously, I like to do this kind of planning page at the end of every month, just so that I can organize my ideas for the month coming. For December I've decided that my theme is going to be Christmas. I know, I'm incredibly original. I haven't yet thought so much about my colour palette, but I know I want to do something that's maybe not so traditionally Christmas, or at least nothing cold Christmas related, if that kind of makes sense. Down here in the southern hemisphere Christmas is actually in summer, so I don't want any of those wintry kind of colours. I also in this spread like to write down some of the things that I'm going to want to include in my monthly setup. These are all of the pages that I can think of at the moment, but there might be a few more that I want to add before November's over. In terms of my intentions for today, one of these items is the booking of my restricted license test. 
Getting my restricted has been a goal of mine for quite a few years now, so I'm kind of excited but also somewhat nervous to finally be getting this done. Obviously in terms of actually getting this license, my next actionable step is just to book my restricted test in. The question I want to leave you guys with is, what's one goal that you've been working on for a while, and what's one small step that you can take today to help you reach that goal? Thank you for watching, if you liked today's video please do make sure to give it a big thumbs up, and I'll see you again tomorrow for day 18. So until next time, bye!